fairies come to Fields and hills were covered with deep snow. And the rabbit had nothing to eat. She went out to search for food and found two carrots. The rabbit ate one of the carrots and then thought to herself, it is snowing so much and is bitterly cold. Surely Donkey has nothing to eat. I shall bring this carrot to him. <clears throat> Rabbit went right away to Donkey's home. But Donkey was not there. Rabbit left the carrot there and hopped back home. Donkey had also gone out to look for food. He found a couple of potatoes and went back home satisfied. When he opened the door, he saw a carrot. From where could this carrot have come? Donkey wondered. Then he ate his potatoes and thought, it is snowing so much and is so bitterly cold. Surely lamb has nothing to eat. I shall bring this carrot to her. He brought the carrot to Lamb's home, but Lamb was not there. Carefully, 
he laid the carrot inside and went back home. Let Lamb had also gone out to search for food. She found a head of cabbage and went back home satisfied. When she opened the door, she saw the carrot. From where could this carrot have come? Lamb wondered. Then she ate the head of cabbage and thought, it is snowing so much and is so bitterly cold. Surely deer has nothing to eat. I shall bring this carrot to him. Lamb took the carrot and carried it to Deer's home. But he was not there. The lamb laid the carrot down and ran quickly back home. Deer had also gone out in search of food. He found some green leaves and went home quite satisfied. When he opened the door, he saw the carrot. From where could this carrot have come? Deer wondered. Then he ate the green leaves. and thought, it is snowing so much and is so bitterly cold. Surely rabbit has nothing to eat. I shall give this beautiful carrot to her. The deer ran quickly to rabbit's house. But rabbit had eaten until she was full and had gone to bed and was asleep. Deer did not wish to waken her. So, so he very quietly laid the carrot inside the door. When rabbit awoke. She rubbed her eyes in wonder. The carrot was back again. She thought it over for a moment, then said, surely a good friend has brought this carrot to me. Then she ate the carrot all up and it tasted very good.
stars, and moon, and sun. And now our story is done. Little candle, shining bright. Thank you for your radiant light. Good night.